I'm David Story. This is Look News on Demand for February 12th. A Warren County woman has been arrested after trying to burn down an apartment while her boyfriend slept inside. The Warren County Sheriff's Office says 29-year-old Sadie Robinson of Warrensburg is accused of placing a can of WD-40 in an oven at the Main Street apartment she and her boyfriend shared, causing the heated WD-40 to fill the apartment with smoke. Robinson then allegedly left the residence and purchased an airline ticket to Florida for her and their two infant children using a stolen $2,500 IRS card. The victim was awakened by smoke detectors and called police. Robinson was apprehended Monday morning at the airport and charged with felony assault and grand larceny. She's locked up at the Warren County Jail on $40,000 bail. A Lake Luzerne man who held police at bay during a standoff Sunday is locked up at the Warren County Jail. Under Sheriff Sean Lamery tells Look News that 40-year-old Ted Backus was arrested after the armed standoff at the Waterhouse restaurant on Route 9N in Lake Luzerne Sunday. Police say Backus, who lives above the restaurant, was involved in a domestic dispute and surrendered after police entered the building. No one was seriously injured. Backus is the brother of two Warren County Sheriff's officers and is facing misdemeanor charges of assault and criminal possession of a weapon. A Saratoga Springs man is accused of sharing child pornography online. 34-year-old Jeffrey Humans was arrested early Monday morning after a joint investigation between the Saratoga Springs Police Department and the FBI. Police say that they found numerous videos depicting child pornography on Humans' computer. He is facing child porn and marijuana charges. Classes at his Saratoga County Elementary School canceled Tuesday after a gas leak forced the evacuation of the building. National Grid working to replace 300 feet of pipe after a gas leak Monday afternoon at the Moreau Elementary School in South Glens Falls. Students had to be taken to another school after natural gas was detected in the building. No one was injured and classes are expected to resume on Wednesday. And that's all for this web edition. You can catch Look News on air weeknights at 5.30, 6 and 10 p.m. We're on Time Warner Cable Channels 8 and 508.